Hello foodies, this is Tony. Welcome back to my YouTube channel. Today I'm doing a review of a recent dinner I had at Comtois Abel Bar in Lyon. So this was a Bouchon. It's one of the original Bouchons. It's got a several hundred year history. So I was very excited about this. Bouchons are traditional Lyonese restaurants um, for people kind of to have just kind of very simple, uh, homey type food. Um, they use all the parts of animals and so it's really for the masses in terms of uh, the people just getting a great meal and it's about using um, every part of the um, whatever you know animal that you use not great normally for vegetarians but um, you know, we were really excited to go there so um, it's fairly close to um, the heart of town so uh, you know it's a really neat place to go um, the first impression it looks old and very classic so I was very excited to get there I don't think this is a tourist trap I think a lot of locals there are, but I'm sure um, tourists also go here um, unfortunately the service standard is very traditional stereotypical French service so basically you get there they kind of ignore you if you're not speaking French and um, they'll get to you when they can. So that's unfortunate. Um, and then they try to kind of humor you at the end by giving you great service at the end when you pay the bill. This is fairly typical of olden um, French service. So that's unfortunate, but um, that's how they react to people, I guess. Um, so anyways, we got there. Uh, we were a little early, but kind of given kind of very fairly cold service, like, you know, just sit there wherever you like. and. Uh, we were given menus, but then kind of people ignored us until some nice person, kind of um, a younger waiter, kind of took some sympathy on us and decided to take our order. So um, other than the service standard, um, I thought the food and the value was there. So the um, interior is really nice. Again, everything about the actual food other than the service is actually quite nice. And it's really mostly management. I actually think the higher ups of the um, restaurant, the young people I think are actually pretty um, good, but as and everyone seems very hard working there. It's just, I think they take the lead from the management people who kind of are very again very stereotypical French they make jokes that they think are funny but they're not really are kind of very condescending quite frankly so anyways um, un that's unfortunate um, but again the interior and if you can kind of get around that um, and just focus on the food um, it's really quite a nice place to eat so we sat inside and we got a good view of the action and there's a lot of bustling movement it seemed like everyone was working hard little video of the interior of the restaurant it's lined with um, kind of aged things and uh, again the surroundings is kind of neat everyone's just uh, working away um, you'll see at the counter they have bottles of wine um, that are very inexpensive. They have Rhone and Beaujolais Village wines for I think like eight euro for a half bottle. So very good. Um, they do have some bread that they keep, they reuse. So I don't know if that's a French thing. Uh, and I've asked uh, kind of subscribers and viewers to comment on that. I guess it's good because you're not wasting bread. And I find that a lot of it seemed like a lot of the French tables they drink they eat a lot of bread um, but I did get to see that you know uneaten bread was poured back into this um, larger bin and then reused again first dish we shared was the Leonese salad which is a really good deal for 14 euro if you're sharing between two people it's quite hearty it's got chunks of bacon or pork or meat um, with some croutons and whole egg so um, compared to what we would see at least in Vancouver it's a little bit more salty um, a little more rich flavor the ones that we have the Leonese salads in Vancouver are much lighter and I think a little bit healthier um, but you know this is a Bouchon so they go old school on uh, how things are made and I don't think um, people in the 1800s were as concerned about um, you know calories and things like that 
Next, we had one of their signature dishes, which is a uh, pike quenelle, which is for 26 euro, which is not bad, I think. Um, so quenelle is a Lyonnaise dish, which is a mixture of creamed uh, fish or meat um, that's combined with breadcrumbs and a light egg binding to form egg-like sh shape, um, kind of uh, tubular. Um, it looks like almost like a a fish right so um, it's like a dumpling I would say a fish dumpling they also have a I think a crab dumpling but this was good it has a little bit of fish smell uh, taste to it but it's really like a dumpling it tastes like a dumpling and there's some cream sauce on it so it's quite nice um, you know it's something you should try when you're in Lyon I don't think it's like my favorite dish but you know it was I think it was done well um, and it wasn't that expensive here is a video of the plating of the quenelle. So um, it's done table side from a pan. Looks kind of nice. It's a huge portion actually. So for one person, it's quite a bit of dumpling. Uh, if you share it between two or four people, that's kind of a nice dish. Got a nice creamy, almost like mushroomy sauce. So I like that. And then the next dish we had was another one of the specials, which is their chicken and morel mushroom. Um, again, nice dish, and it's um, $32. Uh, I don't think it's 32 euros, sorry. It's not expensive, I think, for what it is. Um, there's some quality there. The um, chicken was okay, so everything was um, tasty. Uh, I wouldn't say, you know, knocked our socks off. So for that reason, and because the service was um, kind of uh, uppity and aloof, I'm going to give it a not recommend just because I don't think there's any special reason to go to this Bouchon, although I think you should go to a Bouchon in Lyon. I don't think it matters too much, especially with this um, famous Bouchon to go here. So that's why I'm not recommending it. Hope you enjoyed this video. Until next time, happy eating.